Welcome to Murray Mysteries. So, you think the Count did it? That's what I said. His master, that's Dracula. But why attack him? I was devoted to him. That's what I don't understand. He's stable enough to talk now. He said he wanted to see you, Dr. Seward, and your friends. I suppose we're getting some answers. Ah, how are you feeling? Not my best, I must say. I seem to be largely unable to move. Yes, the doctor said the damage to your spine was extensive. I'm afraid parts of you might be paralyzed forever. That is... unfortunate. Ah, uh, what happened? You said your master did this, but why would he hurt you? Because I turned on him. That night, the night I asked you to let me go, he came to my window. He promised me eternal life, said he would come back for me. But I waited too long. I was impatient. When he finally came back, I was angry. So angry I almost didn't notice him. Him... Dracula? No, the other one. The young man. I'd never seen him before, but I knew who he was. You told me about him during your visits, Miss Murray. He looked just as kind as you described, but so lost. Jonathan. I knew he was hurting him. I didn't want him to be hurt. I didn't want you to be hurt, Miss Murray. So last night, when my master came back, I tried to help. You attacked him? I tried to grab him, to bring him down, but he was too strong. Professor? Yes, I know. We need to go. It could already be too late. Jonathan! No, 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 not again. Well, hello there. I wasn't expecting this to be a party. Get away from him! Everyone, your sacred objects. Oh, we got no time for that. Quincy, no! Damn it! He got away. But... But I... I shot him. How many times do I need to say it? Normal bullets are no use against vampires. Oh, shit, I, I thought- I know. Miss Murray, is Mr. Harker okay? I, I, I think he's waking up. M Mina? I'm here. I'm here, you're okay. I, I had a nightmare, I, I thought- I'm afraid it wasn't a nightmare, Mr. Harker. Dracula was here. What? That monster. He had to go after you again, didn't he? Could stand being outsmarted. We need to go out and find him. He can't have gone far. Mina, no, please, stay. But he hurt you, again. I need to stop him. Jonathan's right, Mina. We're not ready to fight him again tonight. We need to look after each other. <sighs> All right. I'll stay. How are you feeling? I... I don't know. Gosh, there's, there's blood everywhere. I can... taste it. Makes sense. He was making you drink his blood when we came in. What? I didn't see that. It was a split second, but I saw it. There was a cut on his chest. I, I didn't... I... Mina, I'm sorry. I, I didn't know. I, I would never... Hey, hey, hey. Not, none of that. You're the victim here. You did nothing wrong. But no buts. Lady's right. My fists and I are going to teach that creep the meaning of consent. I appreciate the sentiment, Quincy, but... Fists won't do a thing. I get it. Duct tape five stakes to a boxing glove. You watch me. Make me one of those while you're at it. I want in. Everybody calm down. 
This is a very distressing situation, but it won't be made better by running headfirst into vengeful fire. We need to regroup. Figure out where to go from here and how to protect Mr. Harker from any more harm. I agree. Keeping Jonathan safe should be the priority. Can you remember what happened tonight? S sort of. It felt like a bad dream. I, I fell asleep rather quickly, but I kept dreaming about death and vampires and, and blood. I felt like I was surrounded by mist. That's been happening most nights lately. But this time, in the middle of it, I, I could see him. It was like he was the only thing in focus. I tried to move, to, to run, but the mist was holding me down. And he... He came closer, and, and he bit into my neck. It hurt so much, I, I think I lost consciousness, or whatever consciousness is in a dream. Because the next thing I knew, he was in front of me again, asking who he thought we were, hunting him, trying to outsmart him. He, he said there could only be one hunter that, that he would show us. But that's all I remember. That, that and the fear. So much fear. We're going to be okay. We'll figure it out together. Yes. Yes, if anyone can figure it out, it's you. <laughs> Sometimes I think you have too much faith in me. Impossible. I... Yes? This she? Oh. Oh, God. Right. Thank you for letting me know. R is dead. Murray Mysteries is a Nerve Storytelling production. This episode was written and produced by May Tudor and featured Bevan Tankard as Dr. Jane Seward, Rebecca Krause as Professor Van Helsing, Drew Victory as Mina Murray, Jonathan Tilly as Drac, Tom McGinnis as Quincy Morris and Jonathan Harker, Lucy Willis as Art Homewood, Jonathan Tilly as R, and May Tudor as the nurse. Original music by Sophie K. If you like our work and would like to support us, you can sign up for our Patreon at patreon.com forward slash nervestorytelling, or follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and Tumblr. Thank you for listening.